Howdy folks, Daniel Rubino here with WP Central and today I want to give you a quick look at Rowie Lite, the Twitter application that's been in the marketplace for a while but this is an unreleased version I'm going to show you. This is probably coming out this week and it has a new feature in it that I think a lot of people are going to really like because um, it hasn't been done yet as far as I know in other Twitter apps or at least it hasn't been done in this way. You can see the app actually launches very quickly now. This is a Noto uh, HD7 so it's a little bit faster than most uh, of your devices out there. Sorry about that. But um, the app scrolls very nicely. It's a light application. It has basically three sections, your timeline, mentions, and personal messages, of course. Um, but of course, you can also add things to it. So you can do under configure, and then you can also add your own personal feeds, which I think a lot of people enjoy doing. So you can put searches and those kind of things. It only supports one account, which I kind of don't like, but it is a light version. They're coming out with a paid version, which will have more features, including push notifications. Look for that in a couple weeks. But let me show you this new feature that they added. So say you're going to write a tweet, and you want to write it to someone. So you want to say, I want to write to Phil Nickinson at Android. I do at, and I can start typing Phil. And you can see, it starts bringing up all my contacts. And there's Phil Nickinson. And I want to add, say, my, uh, my head editor there, Dieter. Uh, we can do at, and we'll do backlon, and there it goes. And that can even, so you can just keep adding people. And what's great is it's a lookup. It's basically your most frequent people that you contact, and it's automatically saved onto the device. And it makes uh, writing you know, tweets a lot easier and more intuitive. A very cool feature. Outside of that, you can add your photo and tweet. There really isn't, and you can do your current location. So not a whole lot of features. Um, but it doesn't really need many. For a lot of people, they just want a basic Twitter app. You can add photos and tweet and follow people, and that's what this does. And it does it very well. It's fast, it's clean, it's simple, and that autocomplete feature is very cool. So look for that this week, hopefully, in the marketplace. And look for the full paid version with push notifications in a few more weeks as well. There you go. Take care, everybody.